Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It's me, Mr. Four Caps Killer. So, uh, without any further ado, let's go ahead and let's jump right into this. Well, we're going to test both games, Metal Gear Solid 3 and Metal Gear Solid 2. This is the Xbox One X, Xbox 360 HD version of Metal Gear Solid 3 and Metal Gear Solid 2. It is 1080p, but it's being upscaled to 4K. So, the whole point of this video is going to be for me to test to see how well does the uh, upscale to 4K looks on this Samsung Q8FN television. Also, this will be recorded in HDR, so if you're watching this on uh, HDR capable devices such as Samsung uh, Note or iPhone 11 Pro, you can watch this in HDR. Okay, it doesn't have to be 4K, it can be 1080p, 1440p, 720p, HDR is HDR. So, first thing first, I'm going to start with Metal Gear Solid, Metal Gear Solid 2. Start with this, and then uh, we'll see how it looks. Now, these lines that you're seeing, what, that's, what that basically is, that's the lens is reading the free sync. The free sync it's always on on uh, Samsung Q8 FN when the game mode is turned on and maybe I can show that to you really quick you're gonna see the free sync you see there's a free sync right there right above so that's why you're seeing those lines you know go up and down that's the reason why all right so let's start the game I'm gonna turn the volume down because I don't want to get flagged by Konami I think uh, Konami is gonna flag me anyway automatically for this game but I'll read a text for you in a snake voice if you want to Konami Kojima production I meant to say Kojima productions and blue point games for this HD remaster All right, so this is the uh, introduction video. Konami Computer Entertainment Japan presents. I don't know. Do you guys want to see this? Do you want to keep keep this rolling? Or do you want me to go just straight? Let's just go straight to the goodie, to the goodies. Right, straight to the goodies. Let's do this. All right, uh, do a new game. Let's look at the options first. Subtitles, let me see. Caption on. Okay, the captions are on, so subtitles are on. Good, good, good. Let's start the new game. Let's do this. And here we go. This story is fictional. Any and all similarities, never mind. The Hudson River, two years ago, we had a classified intelligence that a new type of metal gear was scheduled for a transport. The whole thing stank, but our noses had been in too cold for too long. I gotta do this because obviously Konami will automatically uh, put the copyright on this video. And I think that's the one thing that sucks about the, this whole YouTube thing. All right, so, so far, so good. Looks good, actually. This is 1080p HD, upscaled to 4K, and uh, looks pretty, pretty darn good. And it should look better on the uh, the HDR because I'm recording this with a 4K HDR, not 4K HDR, but 1080p HDR. I'm sorry. So it should look good. Obviously, there's a the music here. I'm using the same uh, custom settings, the game HDR, game mode settings that I'm using. Obviously, this game does not support HDR. I'm recording with the HDR, but um, 
it's a nice upscale here. When you have a really good source, when you have 1080p source, and then that 1080p source, it's being upscaled to 4K, then the game, it's going to look, look much, much better. And the reason I'm choosing the, uh, the QLED, it's because if I, if I don't use the QLED to do this test, people are going to think I'm an OLED fanboy. OLED fanboy. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. That's what they're going to think. Yeah. Apparently, I'm a, I'm a fanboy that has everything. Paid with his own money. Yeah. Apparently. Look, this is all in-game engine, and it looks pretty, pretty darn good. I like what I'm seeing here. Uh, believe me, guys, this will look much, much better in person. It feels, it feels cleaner. Okay, I'll say this. It feels cleaner. Like, what I want to say about this version, the HD version, it feels much cleaner. Uh, and uh, you will notice this. When you see this for the first time yourself on your television, that it looks much, much cleaner. Now, granted, um, it's difficult for you to, to, to see that through this camera. You, this is why I always tell people you got to see it for yourself in person. But don't worry. If you have a game uh, pass on Xbox, guess what? This game, it's included along with uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. Our boys, it's right on schedule. Shalashashka. He'll know soon enough. Maybe I, sh I should definitely apply for like voiceover. For sure. Produced and directed by Hideo Kojima. Oh yeah, this this is much cleaner, much better. You'll just have to take my word on it. Otacon, do you copy? I gotta do a voiceover. Ring, ring. This is Snake. Do you read me, Otacon? Loud and clear, Snake. Kept you waiting, huh? I'm at the sneak point. Everything going okay? The stealth and the camo busted. Landing impact. We must have overused it. Sorry, but you're going to have to deal with it. You're not in military anymore. Right, I didn't plan on relying on this gadget anyway. The private sector's not so bad. Is it privacy guaranteed? I'm happy as long as no one gives me any more unwanted gifts. And I can't say I missed the chattering nanny. Diverting toys from... SSCN, U.S. Army Soldier System Center. Someone will find out sooner or later. She's better off assuming it sooner and quite while later. Too true. Okay, Snake. <laughs> <laughs> this is the only way I can do it. All Ocelot's doing. Exactly. And now every state group in .com has its own version of Metal Gear. Not exactly a classified weapon for today's nuclear powers. All right, let's just skip through this. You guys know I can do a snake voice. It's not a big deal. The mission objective is to make a visual confirmation of the new Metal Gear being transported by that tanker and bring back. But I want you first to go up to the top level of the bridge. We need to find out where the tanker is headed. Alert reconnaissance, huh? There's too much we don't know about this new prototype. Capabilities, deployment. We don't even know how close it's to completion. If we know where the testing is, I can start to draw some reasonable connection. All right, I'll head to the bridge ASAP. <laughs> Copy that. Now, let me tell you guys, uh, let's get back to the uh, picture quality. My camera here, it's really not doing much. Uh, you'll just have to take my word for it that this is much cleaner. This looks much sharper, much cleaner, and uh, I would say... If you want to play this, play the Xbox One X version. Sure, you can play this on the PlayStation now, but trust me, it's just it's it, it's better. The HD version, it's cleaner, it's better, and it's just when you have a 1080p source upscaled to 4K, guess what? 
it's going to look better. You'll just have to trust me on that. And this game, it's still... You know what? It's been 20 years. 20 years since this game was released. And let me tell you, this game was way ahead of its time when it was released in uh, 2001, PlayStation 2. It, it really is uh, it was way ahead of its time. I got to say that. Yeah, it looks pretty darn good, man. And remember, as I said earlier, uh, even though I'm recording this with a HDR camera, it's still the the lenses cannot depict. Even if I was recording in, in D DLSR, it's still you can't see what I'm seeing in person. And uh, like I said, use those same settings that I gave you guys on my previous video for Samsung Q8FN. HDR game mode settings whether it's HDR or non HDR those game mode settings will work across the board on Q8 Q9 any of the Q Q series 2018 or 2019 doesn't matter Yeah this is definitely I, I mean Yes, I can play this on my PlayStation 2. Yes, I can play this on PlayStation now, but the Xbox version here definitely gives me a much better, cleaner uh, look to it. And it really looks good, man. I haven't tried it on the OLED, but I can only imagine how it would look on the OLED. God forbid I test this game on the OLED. I'm going to be called an OLED fanboy immediately. Looks pretty darn good. All right, so let's go test another game. Let's go test uh, Metal Gear Solid 3. Look, the Sons of Liberty here looks freaking awesome, fantastic. And as a matter of fact, since we're in October, next month, November, it will be a 20 years anniversary since the Metal Gear Solid was released. And it just so happens that Hideo Kojima is releasing Death Stranding that's also in... A close release date of Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty. I think Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty was on uh, November 13th, 13th or something like that. November 13th. But pretty close. You know, November 8th, November 13th. So it kind of, it's symbolic to uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty. All right, let's go to Metal Gear Solid 3 Snake Eater. You know the fact that um, Phil Spencer and Xbox is able to get Konami to release this HD edition on the Game Pass, that shows you just how much Phil Spencer is willing to, to really negotiate to give us the best possible gaming experience on uh, on the Game Pass. And that's why I give the guy a credit, because he really wants to bring us... And Game Pass, honestly, is the best gaming service at the moment. Um, you're not going to find a better deal than a Game Pass. I'm, I guarantee you that. Okay? After the end of the World War II, the world was split in two, east and west. This marked the beginning of the era called the Cold War. That's me doing it, okay? Now let's see how it looks. Wow, this... Uh, remember, we're also using a free sync here, which also helps the smoothness of the, the quality here. I know you can play this on the PC if you can find the PC version. I get that. But uh, what you're getting here with the console, with the Xbox, it's pretty darn good. Yeah, I mean, look guys, I can tell you right now, just looking at this, uh, if you want to play Metal Gear Solid 2 or Metal Gear Solid 3, I definitely say uh, go with a the Xbox version. I was even thinking about maybe doing a live stream of uh, Metal Gear Solid 
three as a solid snake not as a big boss which i have chosen here i thought about maybe doing that but you guys can leave a comment down below if you want me to do that uh, i'll be more than happy to do it to live stream this and um uh Ten eighty P. Yeah, this is good. It's clean. Like the best way for me to explain it, it looks clean. You know. Um I don't know how else to, to say it. It looks clean. No jagged no jagged edged lines. Uh, it's just smooth and clean and very um fluid, you know. Now this is Solid Snake. I, I use the Solid Snake instead of Big Boss. I purposely wanted to do that. It looks great on, on Samsung Q8 FN. I'm pretty sure it's going to look great on a OLED as well, which it should be. Um, so, yeah. But look, check it out for yourself, guys. It's part of Game Pass. It's included. No reason for you not to check this out. Check it out. Doesn't matter if you got TCL or QLED or, or OLED. I think you will appreciate just how clean this version is. It's, it's very clean. And remember, this video is recorded in HDR high dynamic range. as commonly known as HDR 10 plus. So... Uh, Samsung cameras they converted to uh, HDR 10 plus but the YouTube is processing it as HDR 10 okay so that's how that works but anyway I mean there you have it I think uh, I think you might get some idea as to what I'm seeing here, but believe me, I played, I got all the versions of Metal Gear, and I know how the PlayStation 2 version looks versus how the uh, the HD version of the Xbox 360 for the Xbox One X upscaled to 4K looks as, as well. So, uh, at the moment, I would say the, the X version, to me personally, the Xbox One X version of the Metal Gear here is probably your best bet and if you don't believe me if you don't think it's clean and sharp uh, then go ahead and download it it's only eight gigabytes it's on game pass check it out yourself and uh, there you go as a matter of fact I also need to check one more game called uh, Final Fantasy 8 which is available on PlayStation uh, 4 Pro. It's a remastered PlayStation 4 Pro version of the game. I really want to get my hands on that as well. So tomorrow, I don't know, guys. Am I going to do a live stream? I don't know. You let me know down below. Do you want me to do a live stream? If you want me to do it, let me know. Uh, do you want to do a Metal Gear? Or do you want me to do Final Fantasy 8? I would really love to do a Final Fantasy 8. Or whatever. Just let me know. Uh... And then from there, I'll see if I want to do it or not. Okay. But uh, remember, you guys decide whether you want me to do a live stream or not. Okay. I don't want to do a live stream if people are not going to watch it. And I'm not going to waste my time, guys. You know, uh, you guys want, need to want me to do it in order for me to do it. Look, well, there you have it. I said enough. Uh, enjoy it. This looks great as it should be. So there you have it, Metal Gear Solid HD Collection, Metal Gear Solid 2, Metal Gear Solid 3. And uh, come on, Xbox, let's bring Metal Gear Solid 1. Let's upscale that son of a gun to 4K. All right, I'm out of here.